Learning German. Well, we're all coming out of lockdown and realizing there are two different types of people. Those who spent their time at home keeping their German sharp and improving it, and the rest of us that spent our hours on Netflix watching shows in English, and our German got a little bit rusty sitting at home on the couch. So in this video, we are going to talk about a few different ways to get back into your language learning habits online without going to any courses. Hey guys, I'm Josiah. On this channel, we talk about life here in Germany. And in today's video, we're gonna talk about three of the ways in which I commonly learn German online without ever going to a course or a class or I don't use any paper books because that's just not my style. The first easy way to learn language anywhere in the world is with this guy. Apps are a great way to begin learning any language. Two apps that I've used, my wife uses, and a lot of people I know use. One, Duolingo. I mean, not much more needs to be said. Pretty much everyone uses Duolingo. It's great, it's really good for those like three to five minute moments in your day. We just wanna learn some language. Another interesting language learning app is called Busu, Busu, Busu. I'll leave a link down below so you can figure it out. Basically, they've kind of taken a social spin to learning language. It helps connect you with other language learners. So if there's a native German learning, say English, they will actually correct the things you write in German. It's a really cool way to connect with people in different nations and other language learners. I think Busu starts around like 10 euros a month. They have a free plan. Cool one to check out if you're maybe sick or tired of Duolingo and looking for something else to use. The second and one of the best ways to learn any language is through YouTube. Even if you're doing a class, if you're doing a language intensive, YouTube is like blowing up and there are a ton of language channels that are emerging and a lot of them are really, really great. All sorts of different channels for different levels of speakers. You know, you have Learn German with Anya. She's like A1 to A2, super helpful, super clear. Deutsch Lehrer, she's a new one. She's more in the B2 or C1 level. You have Linkster Academy, Richtig Deutsch Sprechen, Easy Deutsch. There are so many and they kind of take a little bit different focuses. They oftentimes offer their own courses on the side that you can pay for, but their YouTube channel and content is all free. If you've found some great YouTubers making great language learning content, hey, share it down in the comment section for the rest of us so that we can discover some great new channels, great new content, and support the work they're doing. Finally, you have online courses. So in the old days, we'd all go do a language course in person, we'd go to a class, and now we are in the era of Zoom and online learning, and we don't need to go anywhere any longer. So in the last year, I've actually participated in a couple of different online language learning schools. These ones definitely cost more than the previous things that I've mentioned but they take a little bit more of the classical approach and are at the same time very helpful. Two of the ones that I found to be interesting are you have one called Deutsche Academy. They're pretty much a classic online Zoom school. So the format is just like you would get when you go to any German course in person. They have three hour classes and it's all done on Zoom. I did one, it was like twice a week, three hours in the evenings. It was good, much better than going anywhere in person. I just couldn't handle the three, three and a half hours our 6 to 9 p.m. teaching sessions at the end of a long day. So if that's your vibe, hey, those things are great. And then I've been testing out Lingoda. It's a lot more modular. You can just pick and choose the competencies that you wanna work on, if you wanna work on grammar, speaking, and all of their sessions are one hour and you just book it whenever you want. I found that to be really helpful as I look at my week and I'm busy and I don't usually have three hours in my evenings to cut out for like three months at a time, but over my lunch or I have an hour here and there. It's a really great online language learning tool that keeps it pretty modular, especially if you're working or you have kids and you have a lot of things going on. Deutsche Academy does, I think for one language intensive, it's like 285 euros. Very similar to the prices you get from an in-person school. Lingoda is quite a bit more expensive, but they do these kind of 
they call them language sprints. So you can sign up for three months and if you complete all the courses, which is 15 courses a month for three months, you get a 50% cash back refund, which brings the total back down to 343 euros, which is still 60 euros more than Deutsche Academy. Uh, so it's still more expensive, but if you are able to do the sprint, it's okay, it's 60 bucks more, but you had also a lot more flexibility. And so that stays very interesting in helping you to learn language and also have a teacher and also have a group online in which you can practice one hour at a time. And those are a few of the ways that I've been getting back into my German learning rhythm. However you're learning German online, hey, let us know in the comments below. We love to hear from one another so that we can all find new sorts of ways to continue sharpening our language skills. Because sometimes, at least for me, I get a little bit sick and tired of doing the same thing over and over and over again. I need to kind of change it up, keep it fresh to keep myself motivated. I hope today's video has been helpful and we'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to leave a like behind. And of course, if you find this sort of content interesting and helpful, be sure to subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.